Hi, John Conley here. How do you create a click track in Pro Tools? Super easy. I've created a brand new blank session, no tracks in it at all. If you don't know how to create a session, check out our video on creating a session in Pro Tools. All right, in Pro Tools, I'm going to go to the track menu at the top of the screen. And at the very bottom of that menu, I'm going to choose create click track. And there it is. My click track is there. If I hit play, I hear a click. If you want to change the tempo, you want to do that in the MIDI controls section of either the edit window or your transport window. And it may not be visible by default. So to make sure that it is, in the edit window, go to the far upper right corner of your screen to the edit window view selector and click on MIDI controls so that it's checked. That will make sure that those MIDI controls are visible. And in that small little area, 120, that's the default tempo. Just click on that. Type in the tempo that you want. Let's go to 92, for instance, and hit return. You got to hit enter. If you don't hear your click, you got to make sure that the click is enabled. And again, that's in the MIDI control section. It's this little metronome button that will turn the click on and off. The shortcut for that is number seven on the numeric keypad section of your keyboard. Seven will turn it on and off. Tap tempo in Pro Tools, if you want to figure out what the tempo is of a song that you have in Pro Tools, just click in the tempo field so that it's green and hit the T key on your keyboard. T. In time with the music and it will calculate the tempo for you. If you know you're going to need a click track in every session, you can enable that preference so that every session automatically has a click track. Really easy to do. Go to the Setup menu in Pro Tools, Preferences, and go to the MIDI tab in the Preferences window and check this box, Automatically Create Click Track in New Sessions. That way the click track will be there waiting for you.